And so this is hopefully going to be an opportunity for us to engage with one another, talk about the weekend that was, talk about the Monday night game ahead of us, talk about some of our clients and some of the guys that you're helping sort of through their careers. There's a lot of circumstances that kind of all intertwine to form the crazy game that is the NFL right now. And, and, and that's one of the things that we're going to be talking about week in and week out here because obviously on the management side and dealing with GMs, you have a ton of experience as a certified NFL agent, former agent of mine. Um, we'll talk about that later. I think I still owe you some money. I think it's going to be a great opportunity once a week at two o'clock on Mondays to kind of connect and sort of check in with where we are, where some of our contacts are, where some of our players are, and kind of just unpack, for lack of a better term, where guys are, where they're going, and sort of the state of football in general. I think it's going to be fantastic. And you and I would be having these conversations anyway. And I, I learned in my limited time so far in television, um, sometimes the best material happens off the set in the green room when you're just talking to a former coach or a former player. And it's going to be a fun opportunity to hang out with you at 45 minutes or so once a week that we're not on the golf course together. So you better not spend too much time here on the Google Hangout because I will sneak out to the driving range and my game will catch up with you. So keep an eye out there, Downey. Yeah, I don't, I don't see that happening at all, even though you're pretty proud of your new little trophy that, you're, uh, that you've held up. This us. trophy, actually. I don't know, folks. We pretty have plenty of time to get into all of my accolades and, and awards, but this is something, as you can see, I carry it around with me everywhere I go. You guys couldn't see the little placard there, but it actually said third place shortest drive competition for fifth graders. So pretty impressive. I'm glad you still have that with you, Kevin. That's great.